Hello everyone, welcome back to Acedo's Kitchen. If you're stopping by for the first time, you're most welcome. And to my subscribers, thank you for your support. Today I am making sukuma. I have an existing sukuma recipe. However, I made a mistake that I wanted to highlight, so I decided to redo this recipe. I start by heating two tablespoons of canola oil and I add the onions. Then I add the tomatoes before the onions turn golden brown. I saute them together until the onion and the tomatoes soften. Once softened, I now add the sukuma, reduce the heat and cover for 2 minutes for the steam to soften and reduce the sukuma. This makes it easier to mix. I am using 2 bunches of sukuma. I now add a tablespoon of vegetable stock powder and cook for another 3 minutes before I turn the heat off. Ensure that you do not overcook it as it loses its nutrients. I now taste the salt to see if it is enough. I added vegetable stock powder and the salt is enough as it is so I will not add any more salt. However, if you prefer to add more salt then please do so according to your preferred taste. The last time I made this recipe I left the sukuma in the pot that I used to cook it in and therefore it was dark in color by the time I served it. This is because the cooking process did not end when I turned off the heat. Once it is ready, transfer it into a separate dish immediately. This would avoid the steam from cooking the sukuma further once the heat is turned off. If you like this recipe and want to see more like it, remember to subscribe and turn on your notifications so you don't miss out on any new recipes I upload. Thank you for watching. That is it for me today and until next time, bye bye.